two, one. Hey, what is going on guys? Such speed here. Welcome back to another video up on the channel. I've literally just woken up. It's something like, wait, hold on, hold on. It's uh, quarter to four in the afternoon. Um, I I really need to fix myself really. And uh, I, I will do that. Don't worry. But anyway, welcome to another video. So today this video is uh, going to be talking about my Badline partnership and uh, pretty much how it's coming to an end. So I, um, if you guys are interested in this kind of video uh, where I pretty much talk to you guys, it's a really important announcement. I'm going to explain a lot in this. Video. Then leave a like on it. Uh, if you guys Guys aren't too interested then there'll be another video tomorrow i hope you guys all enjoy uh leave a like if you guys are excited for this and let's get into it hey so i was just editing this video and i just realized how much i really didn't edit um the commentary i want it to be quite raw um please uh please watch the whole video if you guys want to know exactly why i was leaving bad line and whatever um so yeah i hope you guys enjoy okay and we're in the game so we are still playing on bad line right now because um it was the only thing i could really be bothered to do like usc meetup i don't know i just could not be bothered to play anything else um so uh anyway um i have been a partner on bad line since april i think just before uh yeah i think around april time is when i became a partner um it, within that month and um to begin with i actually thought being a partner would uh really i guess benefit my channel more than the server um i was kind of looking at it from like a business point of view where i guess i was earning a certain amount of income which is really stable for me and it's really good for me because um i have a lot of things that i'm going to be having to pay for in the next couple of months so i was trying to look into investing uh, i guess uh into a server to some extent um you know dedicating myself towards a server which is exactly what being a partner is pretty much it's you know dedicating yourself out there um in a business deal which um it, it still seemed really great to me because for me, I already play on Badline, so for me, it wasn't exactly I had to go out of my way to do anything, apart from maybe promote um, some updates that are happening, with, for example, like Badline Premium, which for me, never really took off. Like, that's my own opinion, and I don't think that's just because of Badline. I think it's because uh, all the partners collectively didn't really use the client at all. Like, I don't use the client. Like, I'm to blame as well, just as much as anyone else, um, and I think that's another reason why I personally haven't really felt too motivated to stick around. So, a couple of days ago, I pretty much... Um, had a discussion with the owners and pretty much just said that i want to do my own thing really i don't want to be um partnered with badline anymore because um i guess it's really more for you guys i mean judging by my comment section you all want me to play on ultra and ultra is currently growing at an insane rate with cheap breaker on the side as well i want to give cheap breaker a go on my channel like i, I want you guys to see it because um I, I think it has a lot of potential like cheap breaker is um it's good stuff i i was one of the first people to use cheap breaker if you guys didn't even know um so i really have got the experience with it i guess i've used it a lot more than a lot of other youtubers that are like now recording with it i had it for like a month before i even became a partner so i had a lot of time to use it in the early stages so i guess i'm quite used to it um however yeah so um even though the title is i'm leaving badline I'm not going to just like stop playing on the server completely. I'm sure I'm going to try out season six and UHC, uh, season 15 and UHC 6.0. That's a no doubt because I, I still want to do play UHCs on both servers. It's not, I'm probably going to play a lot of ultra, maybe even more than Badline because I recently have, that's another reason. Like I found myself playing so much ultra that it doesn't make sense for me to be a Badline partner. Really. Um, I played so much ultra recently just because it's not even just because of how uh, good it is. Really. It's for me. It's uh, my, all my friends are playing on that. It's a community thing. Like I've always been much of a community player like I, I like playing where the community is i like getting involved i like having a competitive scene i suppose and for me um i wasn't really getting that bad line and i don't really think it's a server's fault like I, I i've really avoided all of the drama on twitter like i really don't care for it i it, i think a lot of it is quite petty i must admit like i don't agree with all the drama and it's not just from one side don't get me wrong it's from both sides um like i'm not trying to defend anyone here um, i'm just trying to do my own thing really um, I have another announcement that will be coming out in the next couple of weeks and I'm sure you guys will probably guess what that is um, But yeah, so for the most part This is pretty much because of you guys like judging by my comment section by my stream chat A lot of people are just questioning why am I still a bad line partner and that will be coming to an end um, It's quite complicated to explain what's happening But in the next couple of weeks um, you will start to see I guess uh, ultra content and I guess uh, some other stuff so um, look forward to that because I know I have like five or six games that I can already upload like I already have one games like I'm that's another thing like I'm actually winning games in ultra like I'm winning games quite a bit so that's kind of why I'm pretty happy that I'm able to because it's I feel like with my contract with Badline um, I wasn't allowed to promote ultra for me 
that well i mean it's not even about promoting the server really for me it's just i want to be able to upload it because it's content it's a free it's good uploads like i could do the arena which i actually enjoy i could they have uoc meetup now which i mean it has some work to be done i think personally because um it's it's yeah it's i mean it's different i guess if that's what they're trying to go for it's different to badlands which is a good thing i suppose because i don't really want them to be the same because that's going to cause more drama um so i guess keeping it somewhat different is a good thing um, but UHC is the main thing for me. Like, I love the UHC on there. Um, they've done something really crazy with making EU uh, really good. If you guys don't even know what Ultra is, it's a server that's owned by all my friends. Nesta, um, Nesta Dawson, Dante, Mentally, uh, Stimpy. Um, and I believe that's it. I'm going to get hated if I miss one. But that's like the main YouTube owners. Um, so, yeah. Um, so, I'm pretty happy to announce this, to be honest. Um, I wish Badline the best of luck. Like, there is no bad blood between myself and Badline. I feel like I've been the most active partner um, in terms of uploading the most content just because I upload every single day. And I kind of expressed that to them. I was saying, like, um, you guys can't really hate me because I I have put my, like, as you guys have seen, I've stuck with Badline through the bad times when Ultra first came out. And now I'm finally just kind of wanted to switch over, which... Um, it's nothing towards Badline. Like, I'm not trying to ruin them or anything like that. I, I don't... I want the best for Badline, to be honest. I want them to... Um, I want them to perform still. Um, I just think that the the premium approach for them... Um, they spent, invest a lot of time into it rather than investing time into... Um, and maybe it's not even that. I just personally thought that might be the case. Where uh, they should have invested time into other things, which I think is, like, true. Um, so, yeah. Um, but... Yeah, like, to be honest, I, for the most part, I've ignored all the comments of me switching to, uh, people trying to get me to switch to Ultra, because I knew this was eventually going to happen, so I wasn't too worried about people, like, um, you know, spamming it, because I knew this is what people are going to want, and eventually I can provide this, um, aka now. Um, so, throughout August, um, towards the end of August, you'll see a lot of Ultra, a lot of Ultra. I'll be doing collabs with Nestor and everyone else, like, we'll be doing challenges and stuff. It's going to be good, like, it'll be like old times, because I feel like I've missed them on my channel quite a bit, like, Nestor, Dawson, um, and Daniel a little bit. I want to I want to implement Daniel into my channel, because Daniel's a great guy. Um, so, yeah, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm excited for things to come. Um, I think it's going to be good. I don't think people should get caught up between the drama between both servers. You should really play what you just enjoy more. And um, I guess let you enjoy the experience of one server. Then, you know, that by all means, don't flame the other server. You know what I mean? Like, um, I, I just, I don't think there should be any drama between servers. Um, I think it's quite petty. And I think that's another reason why both servers initially took a lot of damage from drama with each other. Um, I would say more so Badline than Ultra, 100%. Because obviously Badline was already the bigger server, so it's only going to go downhill if they create drama. It's not going to go uphill. Like if you look at it statistically, that's how it would work. Um, but it's um, a drama's an interesting one. Like I don't really, I don't know. I think this kind of drama is petty, um, but I, th I think it's slowing down now, which is good to see. Because I both servers are my friends really, and I don't really want to see drama between them. Um, but yeah, leaving Badline was my own decision. I wasn't influenced by anyone really. Um, Apart from, I guess, all my friends playing Ultra. I mean, like, they didn't tell me to leave. It's just, well, I'm sure they did as a joke at some point. But, um, like, it's not really, uh, it was my own decision entirely. Um, and I've been thinking about it for a while. Like, I was contemplating it just before VidCon. But then I kind of wanted to, like, I felt like I, was, I had been there for two, like, not, not such a long time. And I kind of wanted to, you know, make sure that I see the bad line through. You know, hopefully see them stable still. I was trying to promote them as much as I can. Just, I really wasn't about to use bad line client personally. Like, I wasn't, I'm not a fan of it. Uh, um, but I, I, I don't know. Um, recently I found UHC is a lot more non-interesting. So, um, I still have a couple games. Like, I still do UHC highlights on Badline. It's just, it's a lot harder to get games because, um, I get all in by literally everyone that's, uh, pretty much IP banned because, yeah. But, um, I'm gonna try and keep my Badline catching X-ray series open, um, for the next couple of weeks. I'll try and make that still a weekly thing, so don't worry. Um, I'll, I'll try, see what I can do. I, I mean... When I've left it being a partner, I don't know if uh, I'll still be able to do that um, because I don't think they'll give me mod perms and stuff. But let's stick. <laughs> okay, let me get my water. What am I doing? Let me get that rod too. <clears throat> so anyway, we're winning a game of UHC meetup here. Hopefully, I've got a sharp five, so he has really good fucking armor as well. Like that's the annoying part. Um, but I'm literally 90. If you guys, oh what the fuck? Like literally, what are you doing? Stop. Like, are they teaming or like what? Like I'm I'm confused. This, I, I'm sorry, I, I'm not, I'm not going to get triggered, but like, no healing. He's at four hearts, he's fucking dead. Kill him, kill him. What do you mean, wait? Don't give him healing, what are you doing? Fuck off. 
What? Alright. Wh what? Band? Are you doing this? Fucking dead. What are you doing? Stop creeping me out. Fucking me. Fucking hell. Okay, sorry. That triggers me more than anything, though. Like, why the fuck are you teaming? Literally, because I literally cock you in 1v1 and you can't handle it. Like, fucking hell. Fucking A, boys. Get clipped. <laughs> oh, you're dead. Good night. Fuck me. I'm on the fours, man. That was so triggering. Why the fuck would they team like that? So AIDS. All right. Well, anyway. Sadly, we ended the video off on a big, big grumpy face, considering we just got a crit out by this guy who literally dropped him healing. I would have gone for him, but yeah, I didn't want to get like quick dropped. So I hope you guys did enjoy this video. I know this is quite a, maybe a big shocker to some people. Um, I've kind of hinted towards it on my streams for like the past couple of days. So it shouldn't be too much of a shock for people. I mean, this was eventually going to happen for me. I wasn't about to like stick with, with a server unless they offer me something crazy like owner. I mean, then I'm entitled to, but I, <laughs> I, I actually don't know if I would like to own Badline. That's a big, big job. And I have uh, a lot of other love the thing going on in my life and that definitely they would never ask me so anyway i hope you guys did enjoy um i i'm gonna try and continue with um i guess uploading some bad line content um for the most part for like the next couple of weeks it's still gonna be relatively bad line but you'll st you'll st you'll soon see ultra on my channel um so i'm happy to announce that so that's pretty good but um yeah just keep the support up guys i'm actually gonna be releasing a texture pack at 160k not this pack not this pack this is uh not my pack but one of my packs that I've been using on stream at 160k subscribers. So if you guys are new around here and you want to subscribe, feel free to do so. And I hope you guys all enjoy the video.